basic fundamental to understand customer wants. Let me first catch your attention on wants. What is wants? Wants is desire. The moment you satisfy the desire, another desire comes up. It is never ending. Human, it is a human, it is a human tendency. Customer is human, which we as a marketing people or sales team need to deal in a daily life. The moment you satisfy the customer requirement, another requirement of customer will come in. It is never ending. How to satisfy customer? Is it price, service, product? What is an important goal? Before discussing about the customer satisfactions, first we need to understand the customer. Once you are able to understand the customer very well, it will be easy for you to manage or to keep the customer happy. Is there a different kind of customers? Uh, yes, uh, you know, uh, let me tell you that I am not a knowledgeable person, but I love knowledge. I am not a scientist, but in, a, in life, I experiment and I learn from it. My thoughts are not from apprehensions, but from observations. I learn from the observations. I had completed my 15 years in sales. So, therefore, you know, I can tell you that, you know, easily I can tell you that, yes, what I identified is there are two types of a customers. One is emotional customers, and the second is a tricky customers. Emotional customers. There is a saying, we might be the masters of our own thoughts, still we are the slaves of our own emotions. When we talk about the emotional customers, these customers are very highly sensitive. This customer will give the preference to those who have helped them at the initial phase of their business launch. Therefore, we as a marketing people need to identify this kind of a customer. This kind of a customers can be basically identified by the expert marketing guy or person. We have to make sure as a sales, we have to make sure that you know we need to be updated these guys, these customers very closely. As I said, they are highly sensitive. We need to respect them. We need to respect to each and every customer, but we have to pay a little more attention to the emotional customers because there is a chance that, you know, there is a, I can say that 98% there is a chance that we can convert emotional customers into dedicated or loyal customers. I don't mind giving lot of respect, lot of attention to the emotional customers or any of the customers because according to me, Customer is the one who pays me a salary. It is not my company. It is a customer who pays the salary. Ladies and gentlemen, I just want to tell you to each and everybody that customer is the one who pays the check, not the company. Let's talk about the tricky customers. The second category of the customers. Tricky customers is exactly opposite of emotional customers. They will be very harsh. They will be very harsh at the initial phase of the meeting. When you go to the meeting, they will be very rude. They will push you hard to get a better deal. Rest assured, the moment you give them a better deal, they are the one who will go and open it in front of your competitor and they will negotiate with them too. This kind of a customers need to be understood very well by the marketing or the sales guy. As I said earlier, customer is the one who pays you the check. It is not your company. As it has become a duty for the sales or a marketing guy to identify this kind of a customer very well in advance. Now the question arises, how to handle this kind of a customer? Once you identify this kind of a customer, you have to see the guy who is very close to this customer in his office. For you, not only this customer is important, but that guy will also going to play a very, very crucial and important role. In order to retain or to get the business, you need to satisfy and keep happy 
both this person. This customers, tricky customers is exactly as I said earlier, they are exactly opposite of emotional customers. Tricky customers doesn't like to deal or to talk about the personal matters. Whereas emotional customers talk about the personal matters, but occasionally. So here we have discussed about the two customers, type of two customers I can say. One is emotional customers and second is a tricky customers. Once you identify these two guys, these two customers category, then it will be easy for you to capture the market, to capture the business and to make them happy what they want.